show you how to optimize artist year posts and title tags for SEO using Simple Find and Replace and any HTML text editor. Basically, you need to start by opening the following files in any artist year WordPress theme. So I have uh, an old website called Top 5 Hosting. Uh, the site needs a serious reboot, but for starters, I'm going to see if I can salvage some of the content that's on it. I'm going to start by making sure that I've optimized the tags on this particular theme. And I'm going to use Dreamweaver. I'm also going to pull up uh, the IE6 hack file as well, just to make sure I cover all my bases. I'm not going to work in the archive or archives file because I'm not going to be doing any work to uh, worry about categories because I'm going to have those non indexed in the first place. Once I'm in here, I'm going to focus on the header.php file first. You can see here that this is identified with an H1 tag, and I'm going to flip that over to an H2 tag. And I'm going to go to the index.php folder. And I'm going to switch this to an H1. I'm going to copy this section real quick. I could do a find and replace. I'm going to go through each of these files and simply select that same section all over again, paste over top of it, and save all so I don't lose those quick files. Now, at this point, each of my pages have been updated. I haven't uploaded them to the server yet, but if I sent them up there, my style settings might not jive with what I'm shooting for. So I need to come in here and take a look at a couple different areas in my style sheets. First of those is the H1 art logo section. So this would normally drive our header. This is the same code that stylizes this. So that's currently an H1 tag. We want to change that into an H2 tag. So first I'm going to focus on this section and I'm going to do a simple find and replace within the section. changing the h1.art to h2.art. If I did just h1, that would be too generic. So I'm going to replace that. Now we've covered each of those sections within our style sheet. Now let's take a look at our H2 in general. Where does this show up? These are the ones that we've already converted. And we can see a number of items here that are treated the same. You will notice that for our H1s and H2s, we have the same font size. When I designed this theme in Art to Steer, I came into the heading section and utilized the same font size. The colors are slightly different, something I've neglected to make the same. But if I go to size and I set these two sizes the same, I can change back and forth without having to worry about changes in my CSS for either of these both set to 24 pixels. Just to make sure that I don't have any other issues, I'm going to make sure that the colors are same here in the style sheet. Now let's double check our Internet Explorer 6 hacks. The only item here deals with the margins. So I'm going to standardize this so that they have the same margins. files have been saved. So I'm going to close these down. I'm going to upload these to the site. And we 
can double check our site by simply refreshing and make sure that everything looks the same. And as you can see, let's take a quick look and now you can see that we've got an H1 tag for our article titles and an H2 tag up here. So there you have it. We've just optimized this site such that the articles will be the key item that the search engines will pay attention to as opposed to the name of the site.